Hello folks. I've had some digital guitars in my day, including these Casios and even this Suzuki Digisynth. So when I heard about the Inspired Instruments digital guitar and its features, I had to have one. I'm not a great guitarist, and with my age sneaking up on me, my fingers aren't as nimble as when I was a kid. But I present this fantastic unit for you to see and hear best as I can. This is only partial as there is such an abundance of features and information that I cannot show it all in this video. See the description box for more info and this is best watched in 640p. The only strings are actually over the bridge. The removable fretboard has simulated nylon touch sensitive strings and it's great, it's always in tune. Using the optional GameFlex cartridges that plug into the side, you can actually use this guitar as a game controller for Wii, Guitar Hero, or others. And with the MIDI out, you can also compose with GarageBand or other music programs. And of course, my favorite is being able to plug in your iPod, MP3, CD player, and play right along with your favorite tunes. There's 100 beats, 50 synthesizer voices, 25 guitar sounds, slide, open tuning, and the U-Rock mode for learning. Only four AA batteries are required, and you can plug this guitar into your Fender Super Reverb and you'll not believe how good it sounds. Here I use a small portable Esteban amp. You know, I just got my U-Rock guitar, <laughs> and I'm not kidding you. I'm blown away. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm reading the book. There is just so much stuff to do here. But, you know, I mean, just the way it sounds and plays, I'm blown away, you know, like... You change... You change everything here. The sound. This demonstrates the slide. It slides up the chord. This is when you have the slide button. Amazing. Number 58. Play. These only look and feel like strings, but they're so easy to play, you just touch them. You'll note there's no tuning head. The heads can be ordered any way you'd like to customize them, and they just simply plug in. Uh, they'll be available soon. changes up to 50 different synths that this has in it and there's a list in the catalog it goes anywhere from acoustic piano harpsichord vibraphone organs nylon string guitar bass cello all these things sounds uh, unbelievable different things that we can put in here uh, 49 is a banjo when you strike a string lights light up for each spring. If you put this in game mode, this immediately changes the entire guitar over to work with any of the Guitar Hero games and such like that. Just plug it in and you've got your controller down here that does all of the same things on your 
con control, just a regular joystick here. And that will do that. So that's perfect. So if you want to play the music though, you turn on the music, you pick the kind of beat that you want, like uh, U Rock mode helps you learn more, the synth mode is something else. This is my favorite. Plug in the MP3 player and jam along with John Ford. You can save any combination of instruments and beats. You can also record your own rhythm and then play back with it. Okay, let's record some tracks, sound on sound. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is play the background rhythm with the cue chord. And uh, I've got it set up here. All I have to do on my Movie Edit Pro is record the first track. So here we go. Let's see how this goes. This is Suzy Q. Well, say that you'll be mine. Well, say that you'll be mine. Well, say that you'll be mine, baby, all the time. Say Now I'll add the guitar. The music you're hearing now are the three tracks I recorded, sound on sound. 